Dignus! Your madness ends here! Are you ready to pay for your crimes? My crimes? You know nothing, boy. You can't talk your way out of this. How many innocent men died because of you? I killed innocent men? Ha! There is no such thing as an innocent man. What? The people of this world simply sit and wait for their own doom. Living such a life is blasphemy against life itself. I believe that is the gravest of sins. So you judge them? Who gave you the right to punish other human beings? I am punishing no one. Any punishment would be too good for this forsaken world. Then what are you doing this for? I am searching. I am searching for purpose, for myself and for others. Purpose? Lives dashed against one another, the burning of a man's soul. War is the only proof of existence. We're fulfilled only on the battlefield. You formed an army just for the sake of fighting? I did not wish to lead an army. My only desire was combat. I killed those who fled, and spared those who fought back. Like a kidna. Others ascribed meaning to my life and began preaching my ideals. Kror. I seek to fight the strong. Yet as I continued to conquer, my legion grew vast, and I required an even stronger foe. It was for this reason the woman approached me. Nebula. The Nox tempted me. She asked me to raise the continent with war and revolt against Fortuna. You knowingly let her use you. I mobilized the Legion at her advice and marched on Fortuna. What should have been my greatest foe fell before me like straw. Disappointed, I allowed the Prince to escape and took the High Priestess hostage. Then I simply waited for a revolt. You killed my mother for that? My kingdom fell because you wanted a challenge? I'll never forgive you, you bastard! Like most of mankind, you have a warrior's tongue, Prince. But I tire of mankind's weakness. That is why I've challenged God. Challenged God? He is the last opponent worthy to face me. I will destroy this world before God does. They have already restored the world. God wishes not for destruction. Your challenge is in vain. No, not in vain, Priestess. Standing before me are mortals who would still face me in battle. Young and weak as they may be, this is what I desire. What? You've killed thousands of people because of your desire? A world unable to satisfy my desires is a sinful one. The world was reborn. We dedicated our lives to giving this world hope for a future. Your tainted views have no place here. Yes, that's it. Release your anger. Give me my finest battle.
too slow.
What a joke. Die! Lucky shot. Disappointing. You're better than I thought, kid. I'm impressed. <sighs> <sighs> 
Give up. It's over. I'm just getting started. Move, damn it! I'll keep fighting beyond the confines of this weak body. I'm still alive, aren't I? What the hell are you waiting for? How can you keep fighting? Is it over? What's happening? Oh, my lord. Answer my cry. Punish these foolish humans. Let your hatred wash over humanity. Flood them with your violent rage. Bless me with the powers of ultimate destruction. Descend upon me, my lord, Dies Irae! Nebula, you died. What are you doing here? God answered my prayer. He has resurrected me to bear witness to the end of the world. That's just an idol created by your own anger and hatred. You're talking nonsense. The God of Destruction has descended upon us. What more proof do you need than my resurrected body? God's wills, total annihilation. Can't you see you're wrong? God doesn't want humans to die. A fool like you knows nothing of God's will. God is angry. He is lamenting. He will destroy this world in order to purify it. How do you fail to understand? Because that isn't true. God isn't trying to purify the world. He watches over us and listens to our prayers. Humanity has hope again. Humans are shameful and weak. They perpetuate further weakness to hide their own iniquities. Worse yet, they torment the weak around them and call themselves strong. Humans believe this gives them purpose. Some humans may do that. But you can't judge all of mankind by the mistakes of misguided men. I learned this sinfulness long ago and spent my life cursing men's injustice. Before long, God spoke to me. His will and my desire are one. Purify the world through destruction. I understand now. You fabricated God's will in your own mind. It isn't your duty as a prophet that binds you to your belief. It's your own rage. The voiceless rage of your own humanity bottled up inside of you created the God of Destruction. Silence! I am God's servant. You cannot stop the end. All you wretches can do now is cry and beg for forgiveness that won't come. I won't ask your hollow God for forgiveness. We humans caused all this tragedy, and we humans will end it. If I ask anything of God, 
He will be to watch over us and witness our resolve. 